Welcome to Entrance Health Library. Although this product is designed to be used during exercise, care and common sense should be used. Do not use machinery and stop immediately if you feel unsteady or unwell. You may wish to fix a daydream stare on a comfortable spot in front of you. But do not close your eyes during exercise. You may find that your mind wants to wander, to wander. and that's fine. Consciously listening, or not consciously, it might not give it from really. Your subconscious will be looking at this at every monster, regardless. And you can know that every time I say the word, the word and number two, two from this from moment, moment on, you can realize twice as much as you already, already are. Whenever you do hear me say the word for the number two, all that you have to do is to either listen or not to listen to the sound of my voice and remain relaxed as I talk to you. And you begin to know what you thought you really don't know. As each time you listen to this very powerful program, you will notice the more and more, and more beneficial, deeper, more profound results to you. You will always either eventually consciously and always subconsciously notice that there will be times during the program where there will be nothing except a gentle pulse and music. 
When you're conscious, you're so subconscious, you might have no idea. Then I want to begin to focus on the thoughts and all the feelings, the very positive and happy thoughts and feelings, which are the desire, the desire of what you are achieving. Because you are happy, 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 you can indeed be solved by that very same mind. You have the solution to your problems already. Whilst there are many shades of grey, essentially, they are all either dark or light. Without knowing, you are developing yourself already. Now, imagine yourself at the beginning of a very long corridor. You're just setting out on a long journey. As you pass along the corridor, you notice on either side of the corridor are doors. Some are open wide, and some are closed, and one or two are ajar. At the end of the corridor is a T-junction, so you'll have to choose whether to go left or whether to go right. But right now, you're just setting off down the corridor. On some of the walls are paintings, and other walls are bare. 
you're here, walking down the corridor, looking for clues, like a detective. You want to free yourself of information you've been carrying about with you for too long now. Walk down the corridor, and soon you will come to a door. This door is different somehow to the others. It's not the colour of the door, or what it's made from. It just feels right somehow. And you try the door, and the door opens for you. You enter the room, and to your surprise, it's just an empty room. The only thing it contains is a grey filing cabinet and a window. You walk over to the filing cabinet and try the drawers. One of the drawers is stiff, but the others pull out quite smoothly. Look through the drawers. What do you see? What is being hidden or hoarded in the drawer? You've come here at this time to learn more about what is stopping you from feeling inner peace. In one of the drawers are some files, which I want you to locate. Look through the folders and files. Notice what is stored here. Okay, take the files out one by one until you find one file that contains something significant. Some papers perhaps, or photographs, or pictures. Take a few seconds to find it. Now, look through the papers and remember to look on the back as well. You're looking for a clue, some memory from the past. Take out each paper and look very carefully. It may contain just one word or one sentence, or there could be pictures or photographs, a name perhaps. Something will come to mind. I'm going to count from three, and then something will come into your mind. A word, a name, a thought, an idea or a memory. One, two, three. Now, focus vividly on that thing that springs to mind here. What is being hidden away in this secret folder? Is it linked to something? Or is it a direct reference? In a few minutes, a few hours, or a few days, you will associate what is linked to these files. You will slowly realize what it is you need to release from your unconscious mind. In a few minutes, or a few hours, or a few days you will release from your unconscious mind what you have realized, restoring your peace of mind. You can retake this session often to help coax more hidden feelings and memories to the surface and release them permanently, restoring your peace of mind. You will remember everything that has happened and you will continue to remember things associated with these folders and files over the next few days. You will continue to release things associated with these folders and files over the next few days. And these ideas now make a deep impression on your creative subconscious mind. These ideas now take root in the fertile soil of your deepest being and they continue to grow 
and expand and permeate every part of you.